Hey, hey everybody. Now that it is officially October, I'm going to do Strathholm for my Halloween special. Um, <clears throat> this is the five-man dungeon uh, from Vanilla, actually. Um, I haven't done the complete dungeon probably since the Burning Crusade, but I have done the back gate, which is over here, and I'll sh fly over there real quick to show you. There is a back gate just to get to the undead side. There's a living side and a dead side of this uh, instance, and this is the, uh, let's see if I can find it. It's right over here somewhere. There it is in the distance. There it is. This is the, uh, East Wall Gate, as they call it. Back in, you know, vanilla and everything, we used to call this the, uh, the Undead Side. This is where you want to go to do, like, Baron Rivendar to get the Rivendar mount. I don't think it's, I don't think he's called Baron Rivendar anymore. It's somebody different, because Baron Rivendar is officially one of the four horsemen in Nax Ramus. So, I mean, but the dungeon is huge. For a five-man dungeon to do the whole thing, it's a pretty big dungeon. And you can see the smoke there, where the town was set ablaze by Prince Arthas before he became the Lich King. I mean, this dungeon holds a lot of lore in it. This is where uh, Arthas came to chase down Malganus. Ended up going into... Um, right after Malganus to get him. Um, and then followed him to Northrend. What is going on with my sound right now? Turn up a little bit so you can hear the music. All right, here we go. Really pretty easy dungeon. Tons of bosses here. A lot of AOE pulls. So I can imagine back in vanilla how difficult this dungeon would have been um especially with the you know having to do uh cc and everything crowd control so you're gonna have to bear with me through this this is probably gonna be a pretty long run because it's been so long since i've been in here like i mean a long time i think the last time i came here i had to was for a friend of mine who was working on his paladin mount. So we'll clear up there. Like the supply crates, that's where the holy water or something was for the paladin mount. Got an eye on Naxxramas here. Let's take this gate. Work our way through. This is going to be so easy as demonology just because I have the massive AoE of Hellfire. Just have to watch my health with that burning rush. Um, you don't really have to kill all the mobs like I'm doing. You can run past most of them. So, but it's a great lore dungeon. <clears throat> this is where it basically all started for Arthas. I mean, this is where he did something so despicable, you know, killing all the citizens here. Just because he believed they were already, you know, plagued, which they were, because they had eaten the grain, um, and they were going to be undead as as it was anyway. So he came in here to purge Strathholm, chase Malga Malganus to uh, Northrend, and found Frostmourne, became the Lich King. Looks like we have a rare here. Let's kill him. Let's see what's in. I did not get any loot. Alrighty then. I have an insect there though. Alright. There's that gate. Let's go over here and see what's over here. <clears throat> oh. Takes me back to where I was just at. Did not realize that. That I made it through the gate because I was running so fast.
I'm out of reach of those. That's crazy. Let's go back through. Okay, let's turn off that. Burning rush. Bam. There we go. Such creepy music in here, too. You hear that music? There's Timmy. For those of you who don't know, Timmy the Cruel. I don't know the real lore behind him, but I know he does yell, Timmy! When you pull him, like, from... South Park, see right there. Yeah, no loot off of him either. I might want to put my pet on passive. He may be killing stuff before I hit it. So right here is Crusader Square. We'll go in here. The Scarlet Bastion. See, this is why they call it the living side, um, because um, this is supposedly where all the Scarlet Monastery people were. Um, see, this is kind of like a mini version of the Scarlet Monastery dungeon. There's another boss there. All right, this is a pretty fun Halloween run. Like I said, just uh, it's a real easy dungeon now. It's such a high level. We'll go in here. Oh, you know what I forgot to do? Put on my pumpkin helmet. My weighted jack-o'-lantern. And I'm about to put that on real quick. Boom got it on there we go where I'm trying to wear these for our Halloween special runs here so there's some boots that dropped off of him got a mage attacking me from behind I didn't see just saw the arcane missiles missing me Balnazar there you go one of the dread lords the dread lords were running the undead until the lich king decided to uh, take over it was a demonic rune there I remember those um, it was a crafting reagent Drop some cloth boots and a dagger. Let's take a look at that dagger. That's an intel dagger. You know, back at level 44 or 45 or whatever you were, that was a ooh, excellent dagger to have. So we defeated Balnazar. Ooh, you're all dead. Let's run back through here. We'll leave and go back to the. Uh, other side see this was uh, all for like Argent Dawn you know not Argent Crusade but the Argent Dawn rep um, from Light's Old Chapel they'd give you quests to come here and uh, complete this dungeon <clears throat> and The dun like I said the dungeon is so great because it holds so much lore in it from uh, you know for Arthas it was such a such a big it's like a a big piece of the backbone the vertebrae of King Arthas or Prince Arthas shall I say the Lich King uh, without the uh, purging of Stratholme you would not have the Lich King Arthas there's no telling where the story would have went without this so we're gonna run over this way I think we need to go this way to get to the other side Festival Lane. Like this, this is a huge. Stratholme was a huge town. I mean, just take a look how big it is. I'm trying to figure out how to get to the other side. That's back to King Square. Let's see, I went there, killed Timmy. Let's take this off real quick so I don't die. Um, 
Let's go back to King Square real quick. Or no, that's not King Square. This is King Square. Like I said, you gotta bear with me here. I haven't been in here forever. If I can't find my way to the other side, I may dip out and, you know, go to the other side. Because this is the beginning of the instance right here. Let's see. If we go to the right. Click on this. Can't go through there. Click on that. Well, this gate should be open. <clears throat> But it is not. Let's attempt to see if we can walk through it. Nope. Let's open the supply crate. Strathholm Holy Water. <clears throat> I may have to talk to somebody to get him to open up the other side there. We'll find out for sure. Go back over here to where we were. Take that off for a second. Let's regen some health real quick. <clears throat> if I have to, I'll leave and come back in through the the back entrance. But all this should be connected together. From what I remember, I may be wrong but I thought I remember it was all connected together. Let's go back through here and make our way back to where we were. Because there was some quest givers there. Crusaders. We'll turn back on Burning Rush. Run through pretty quickly. Ooh, I did not go down here the horde oh wow this place is huge I did not realize how big this place was <laughs> let's go back up top It's amazing how much these dungeons and old raids dwarf capital cities like Stormwind. It is just, it's crazy. They put so much work into these dungeons. Well, let's see what we got here. Let's talk to you. Wilhelm. Risen Hammersmith. I've already done all those quests. I've already killed all those people. Premium tobacco. Now I may have to exit the instance and come into the back gate. Um, it's been forever since, I, like I said, forever since I've done this dungeon. So we'll run back to the f ins the entrance, leave out, and then come back through the back gate, which I have a key for. Uh, I don't even know if you still need the key for it. I know uh, back, at least through Burning Crusade, you still needed the key, so you had to find somebody with the key to let your group in through the back gate, and then you would kill a boss in there, and he would drop a key, the key for you, so. I have zero loot, zero backspace. I'm going to sell stuff when I leave here. Let's go back to the front here. Gate. Oh, I got blocked in again. Or it, it attempted to block me in. I'm just running back out to the front, so it doesn't matter. They can chase me all they want. Yep, good luck. My pet's on you now. Let's 
Let's put a bandage on here. That bandage did absolutely nothing. Alright, so let's exit out here. And we will go fly over to the back gate real quick. And enter in. And do the other side of Stratholm. Where you would get the uh, Baron Rivendar mount. The Reigns of Rivendar, I think it was called. Rivendar's Death Charger. And I'll show you real quick. I have the mount. Which took me a long time to get, by the way. Here it is. Rivendar's Death Charger. Lord Arius... Rivendar. Yeah, see, that boss used to be Baron Rivendar. Um, I think I got the mount when it, while he was still Baron Rivendar, actually. Do not recall. So we're going to the back entrance here. Let's rebuff. Here we are. Boom. Right back into Stratholm, the other side. This is service entrance. Alright. Run through all these mobs. Yep, see there's the big gate. It just didn't open up, I don't know why. Maybe I had to kill all the bosses and I didn't. Um, it's so hard when you're high level to, you know, to figure out which one is the boss because you just kill stuff so fast um, I mean it just dies so easy this is called the gauntlet um, I'm not sure if it still does it but you used to um, you would have a time to save like it was gonna kill some I can't remember who it was uh, you'd have 45 minutes to complete all of this um, otherwise they would uh, they would kill somebody at the end and if you could save them it was a little extra for you on a quest there so alright that one tower is down we'll run over this way go through here turn that off I used to hate having to run this instance over and over and over just trying to get the Rivendor mount. It was insane. Like, I would just run back out and reset it. Um, it took several attempts because I think the drop rate is lower than 1%. So, there we got it. We got another. We got another one down here. We'll run through. Real quick, like. And here's the last one. Um, you take down these three, um, I call them towers. They're more or less, um, it's hard to say, like plague. Plague Towers or something like that. Um, I don't know the official name of them. You know, if you watch this video and you do know, please comment below. I'd like to know what the official name is for those. Um, so I could uh, correct myself. Go through there. Here's the boss, Magistrate Barthilis. He's the one that would drop the, uh, the key to this uh, back entrance, the service entrance. There it is, key to the city. I'm guessing you still need it <clears throat> to get in here. I'm not real sure. I have, like I said, I have the key, so I don't know. Let's see what this cloak looks like. Yeah, so ugly. But that is it, key to the city. I remember back uh, when we actually had a key ring for all of our keys for the attunements we had and whatnot. 
All right, this is like a like in a little event. You kill all these um, patchwork golems or whatever they're called. You kill all these here. After you kill those, you will have this open up, and it's a boss there. Kill him. The doors stay open. You'll get bombarded with mobs here, undead. Let's see what he dropped real quick. Oh, nothing of importance. You just stand here and AoE them to oblivion. Now we'll wait for another group of ads to come out here. Drop them down and now go down to Lord Ar Arius Rivendar. Put my pet on passive. I don't want him to attack him. I just want to hit him real quick and down him. And so if he dropped the mount, I was gonna, I was gonna flip out so much. <laughs> well, there you go. That is a, it's a slaughterhouse we're in right now. We have destroyed Stratholme. Easy run. Gate here is now open. And I'm going to show you there's like an instance, like a raid instance portal back here. And it's blocked off by a gate. So you'll have to forgive me, but I think this was the way to get to Naxxramas. <clears throat> Old Naxxramas. Where you still had the corrupted Ashbringer before they moved it out to uh, Northrend over in Dragonblight. <clears throat> I'm thinking that's where, you know, the original Naxxramas was. Like I said, I didn't really play in um, vanilla a whole lot, so I never really did Naxxramas. Never really thought about doing Naxxramas because they didn't have Transmog back then or didn't, during Burning Crusade or anything. Um, so I never really thought it even it never even really crossed my mind to do it. If I would have known we were gonna get transmog, I would have done it. So I could have got the tier gear from there and some of the other cool looking weapons from the dungeon that no longer are available. Um like I said, that's a full run of Stratholm five man dungeon from vanilla. Um this was a level I think forty forty something dungeon back in the day I think it was 40 something no it may have been high 50s because this was one of the last zones you would quest in during vanilla to hit 60 so um, that's the full run of Stratholme here for the Halloween special um, I hope you enjoyed the run and you enjoy seeing what you know what comes out of it like I said the one of the main reasons to still do this is to get this the Rivendar's Chargers off the last boss, the mount. It's a cool boss. If you're a human, you can have an undead skeletal horse. <clears throat> like I said, there's two sides. I went in the main entrance and then came around the back entrance to do this side. Um, if you like my videos, you know, please subscribe, like, and comment on them. Also, uh, go follow me on Twitter at Sickness Gaming. Um, I always put up if I get achievements I'm not making videos or when I put new videos up it'll it'll post up on Twitter there um, I love doing these type of old runs for mounts or transmog or whatever also go like my Facebook page uh, it's sickness gaming it's just there's a space in there um, and the at sickness gaming at Twitter is s-i-k-n-e-s-s -E -S -S. it's the name of my warlock here as you see sickness um, Again, thanks for watching, and everybody have a happy Halloween.